My name is Irish Rob. I play bass in The Exploited. I guess the, the most important thing with punk bass is that it has to be dirty, loud and dirty. And then with Exploited, there's, it's just one guitar, so it needs to be, it needs to fill out when there's guitar solos. Uh, I guess, technique-wise, the, uh, the most difficult thing is speed. Um, I suppose what I mean, like maybe a song, uh, an Exploited song like Fight Back, which is... Uh, I like bass to sound deep, so that when they, when there's a guitar on top of it, it's not con it's not smashing into it. There's enough room for both the guitar and the bass to be present, without sort of overpowering each other and then taking you know sucking the life out of each other. Yeah, you know? and just play with the beat. Yeah, and I think punk is more about that than maybe metal or certainly sort of fo folk and uh, you know traditional music. Bass will will be playing li different melody lines, well counter melodies with the guitar. But with punk, it really needs. It's, I think it's always got to be with the drums. A tight rhythm section makes good punk, or to be honest, a shit rhythm section makes terrible punk. <laughs> you know, yeah. Punk isn't as simple as a lot of people make out. I think, yeah. And particularly with the exploited, I mean, it's it is punk. There's no, there's you know, it's undeniably punk, but there's a lot of metal, a lot of thrash metal. When I'm performing, it's the same thing as when I'm watching a band. I don't want to pay you know 30 euro to see shoegazing all night, you know? There should be interaction with the crowd, there should be people moving. If you play 90% correct, I'd, I'd sooner sacrifice 10% of the precision and the technique for a much more enjoyable visual performance as well. Um, it's just a... All good? Yeah, great, <laughs> cool.